So I've got a little bit of a challenge here. A uh, gentleman brought this in yesterday. It's a fuel gauge and a temperature gauge, and I guess we've got some sort of a display panel here. And he claimed it came out of a excavator, and it's going to cost him $1,200 if he has to replace this whole unit. Well, I tried to get this thing apart, and I'm not having much luck because the uh, dials on the gauges seem like they're glued on there. I tried to pull these up, and there's just no way they're going to go without breaking something. And so uh, I figured, well, there's got to be another approach here. Basically, what he complained about was that the switch contacts aren't making good contact here, and, and he, they don't work. So what I did was I took my heat gun here, and I just heated up the plastic a little, and I was able to pull off this layer here, and then I could see the switch contacts down here. And uh, I'm going to show you what happened to them here. Let me see if I can move the camera just a little bit. When I pulled these things up here, and I looked underneath, you could see how they have like burn spots in the middle of them. Uh, for those that don't know, these are the switch contacts. They make contact with the points down here when you push them down. They have kind of a concave shape, so when you push down in this direction, the bottom part sticks out and it makes contact here. Well, two things I'm up against. Uh, this part is, would be an easy enough fix. You can see where it's got like burn marks underneath here. But what I'm concerned about is on the other section of it here on the circuit board itself, you can see where there's actual corrosion to the point. Let me get that on there a little better. It, the actual uh, conductive paint or whatever they have on there is, is not even a, there anymore. And some of the other ones that are there have lost their conductivity. Now, in the past, I've experimented with conductive glue and conductive paint, and I've had some degree of success. But in this case, I don't want to take a chance on something that's not going to last. Here's some wire glue I have. I don't think it's conductive enough. But uh, I just thought I'd throw it out there for the listening audience and see if anybody has any suggestions. Now, this isn't something I can solder onto. These are not. Uh, normal circuit traces here otherwise I just scrape off a little bit of paint and solder on something and you know see if I could repair it that way but that ain't gonna happen in this case and I understand that there's a pen that's got conductive ink in it apparently there's one that uh, claims it has silver in it and it's fairly conductive and you can just draw on the missing traces if any of you have tried that before I'd sure appreciate it if any of you could help me out on this one anyway um, I'll uh, post under the video if it works. If any of you make any suggestions, I'll post what the results were or I'll make a new video or something. So that's where I'm at with this thing. As always, uh, I appreciate the help and I appreciate you watching the video. Thanks.